Chat, are you smarter than a fifth grader? Let's see if you guys are better than me, chat. No one help him? Bro, put your answers in the chat. I'm not gonna trust you guys. I'm gonna trust my own uh my own answer. Because I don't think you guys got the right answer anyway. Hey, wait a minute. Most of you guys are subscribed right now, so please hit the subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell button for notifications. I am tall. Live science, because we're all scientists here. Let's go. Why would I take your answers when I have my own answers and I'm smarter than all of you? A mango is a vegetable, not a fruit. That is false, obviously. False. Mango is a fruit. How is this life science? No one cares. Math, baby, let's go. True or false? The number 103 has a zero in the tens place. Okay, this is an English question, bro. I learned math in French. What the fuck is a tens place? I think tens is this one because one zero is ten. So this has to be true by transitivity. True. Easy, boys. Who said false in the chat? Mika. Look at this guy. Peter Jordanson said false. Bro. Hey. Hola, soy Eva. Hola, yo soy Pan. Buenos dias. See, I can speak Spanish. Okay, you know what? Let's do social studies. That's, we, we need a challenge. It's been too easy so far. Social studies was the hardest option of those five. So we're going to pick the hardest one. This game is biased for Americans. State of Georgia. I thought Georgia was a city. Official nickname of the U.S. state of Georgia. So Apple, it cannot be Apple because Apple is New York. Orange, how can it, can it? So it's either orange or peach by process of elimination. And if it's orange, it cannot be peach. But no one is called orange. Peach is more likely to be a nickname, right? You say, hey, peach, right? Mario and peach. So I'm going to go with my, peach. So the answer is... Peach. Let's go! I got my pe peaches so, hey, out in Georgia. Oh yeah, that's today. that shit. I got my weed why from California. Oh, that shit. True, that's the song. Oh, that's why he says peaches. Oh my god, she's a K-pop fan. This is a is this a new game? How is this in the game? Are right, we going math? Shut, shut up, math. Let's go. No. What is two minus two minus two? I don't think I can do this one, Chad. Third grade. XQC felt third grade. No way I'm dumber than XQC, bro. No way. I re I respect my hometown neighbor, but I have to beat XQC. Spelling and reading. F this is also bias, bro. I read French. What is measurement? Chat, which one do you want? Quick, 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 quick. First person who says the one, I'll pick it. Which one do you guys want? Spelling? Oh, f no, I pressed reading. No. I hate reading. I couldn't even read. I read reading as spelling. Who the f So Benjamin Franklin is the dude on the money. You know, you know what I mean? You know the dude on your money is Benjamin Franklin, right? He was a US president. He was actually a very smart dude and like a polymath. Pretty cool guy. John Hancock. Isn't that a movie? Isn't that a movie guy? Alexander Hamilton. I don't know who that is. Who's a a Alexander Hamilton? Is that the guy in the play Hamilton? So it cannot be Jan Hancock because that's a fake person. It cannot be Benjamin Franklin because that's a president. And why would the president publish a paper under a pseudonym unless he doesn't want to get revealed that he's the president because the periodical is controversial. So it has to be Benjamin Franklin. So the real answer is Benjamin Franklin. Let's go! Dude, I'm actually big braining this. I'm not cheating. I'm not cheating. I'm legit not cheating, bro. I have my hands up. Wait, Benjamin Franklin wasn't a president? Founding father of the United States. Oh, see, I was right. He's a polymath. I said that word. I'm actually smart, bro. Okay, I guess founding father is like approximate to, uh, you know what I mean? John Hancock is also the first leader of the US. Oh, so John Hancock was also a founding father. Polymath, I think, just means someone who can do a lot of things, right? You can be like an engineer, artist, painter, like math. You, you can do everything. I'm a polymath. I can do math. Two plus two equals four. I can do, uh, yeah. Consonants. Oh, I know this one. Consonants is, wait, what's consonants in French? It's consonne, right? Syllab, t'as des syllabes et t'as des cons. Yeah, it's consonne, yeah. Okay, so FR, for real, is not a, is not a syllable. 
So that means it's a consonant. I is a is a syllable. G is a b -b -b -b. okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wait, what? Wait. Oh, okay, okay, oh, okay. Unique ones. Unique ones. Okay. Okay. One, two, three. Four. Wait, there's at least five. Wait, what? Isn't a consonant the opposite of a syllable? What? Or is it how? Is or is it the sound? So frightening. Two. It's two. Oh, vowels. Wait, I chose the wrong one. Wait, did I get the answer right or not? I'm tripping out. What the fuck? What the fuck? How did I lose? I didn't even lose. The question was wrong. There's like eight fucking consonants in there, and the answer was only one, two, three. It was a shit game, bro. F you, Kai. The word was eerie and not frightening. Wait, there's no way. How many consonants appear in the following word, meaning strange or frightening? Oh, did they say eerie? Holy sh! I'm stupid, bro. Two, she two, says the four, word. Five. Where did she six, say the word? Six, Wait, what? Wait. Eerie. eerie she says it oh. bro that's so dumb bro that's that's you can that's there's no way that's my fault there's no shot she says the word eerie like five seconds after reading the question how am i supposed i thought she was just saying eerie like eerie eerie, eerie. like it's her, her she was just saying that like eerie that was a loophole bro we're, we're gonna do this again let's do this again chat we're academic figures here right so let's do academic figures uh, do 20 push-ups if I lose. There's no shot I lose. Alright, chat, which one do you guys want? Vocab? Wait, uh, last round we were at what, 5th grade? Are we, were we at 5th grade? Okay, let me, before I look, come on, speed run this sh Social studies? Pick a hard one. Oh my god, why did I pick this? This is the hard one. They're gonna ask some obscure US bullshit. Oh my god, bro. Oh, I pledge to the country of the United States. It has to be I. You can't say pledge first. You can't say country first. This is a stupid ass question. And the answer is I. Easy. Science. Reading? Reading, bro. You guys are picking the hardest ones for me. What the f is PP lawn stalking? Oh, God, bro. Bro, can I not ask like a. F oh, cheat. I can cheat, right? How many times can I cheat? Three times. But I feel like this is not a good question to cheat because there's only two answers. So there's a 50% chance I get the right one. Right? You know, I, I could either go with one or two, so I'll just go with false. Here's the answer. True. Good FUCK! We hope you've had some fun and learned a lot. Ugh. I am not asking you guys again. Come on, we gotta, we gotta pass this, bro. I can't leave without passing this. Oh, you said life. Let's go. What is the term for the tough protective covering of trees? Huh? Photosynthesis. Woof. Okay, bro. It has to be bark. Baby. Do you have woof. That's that's cannot be wolf. There's no sh There's no way it's and arf, bro. Please. Bark. Okay, Good thank word. God, bro. I'm going to pick I don't know what measurements is. Let's see what this is. Tess wants to make what is this? Cents using only pennies and nickels. What the? What's a nickel? Can, can you guys tell me what's a nickel? Is it 25? Is it a 25? Is it 10? Nickel, is it a 10 or a 5, chat? It's a 5? Okay, then, then it's gotta be 5 then. So he has... If if Tess has 2 nickels, that's 5 plus 5 is 10. 50 minus 10 is 5. So it's 5. You need 5 pennies because each penny is... And penny is 1, right? Boxes. Penny is 1, right? Yeah. 5. Okay. Yeah, right. Who says that shit, bro? Who says nickel? Who says nickel in real life? I said I have 10 cents. Yeah, I'm not from the U.S., bro. Nah, bro. I was in the U.S. for three months, okay? This summer. Literally, I've never heard the word nickel for the, the whole three months. Fake news, bro. The spelling. Oh, f This is hard. How old is this second grade, bro? Okay, let's first determine all the colors in the rainbow, okay? There's blue, red, purple, yellow, pink. What the f***? Isn't it only red? I think it's only red. What even other color is three letters? I don't know any there other colors. Any co There's literally no other color that is three letters. So it has to be one. In America, we call blue blue. <laughs> There's no way, bro. Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. Social studies? No, I am not picking social studies. Get the f out of here, boy. <laughs> I'm not picking social studies. I know you love 
Freaking psychology and shit. I'm not picking social studies. Life science? Okay. True or false? Loam is a type of soil. What is loam? That's not even a word. Loam is a type. Okay, I, I don't know. I'm a cheat. Uh, wait, if I ask the class, th does it mean they give me the true answer or is it just like it might be wrong? And what do you mean I can copy? Is this like we are the class? <laughs> oh, we gotta play this fair. We gotta play this fair. Back. No, we, we gotta be fair, chat. Like, because I don't want to cheat. I don't want to cheat. I'll do a new question. I don't know this. I don't know this. Oh, it's true? Bro, what is a pimpernels? Okay, this is so stupid. I should just answer the last question because now I have a 30% chance. I have a 33% chance of getting it wrong. The last one is 50%. I mean, 33% of getting it right. Flower. Okay, pimpernels. I feel like it sounds like flowers. I, I, I'll go with flowers, chat. Why would she carry insects? Flowers. Yes! Let's go! Alright, which one, chat? I'll let you guys choose. Social? <laughs> oh, this is gonna be a hard one too, bro. This is gonna be some bullshit. Watch this be some obscure. Meaning ever upward, Excelsior is the official motto for what U.S. state? Wow, bro. How am I supposed to know this, bro? It's not New York. Actually, it could be New York. It can't be California, bro. California is not moving. It's not ever upward. California is ever downward, okay? There's a shithole there. It has to be either Massachusetts or New York. But Massachusetts and New York is like kind of similar, bro. It's like the same city. But I feel, I feel like I feel like this is kind of um, bougie, you know? It's like it, it's a bougie thing. And it, it sounds more like Massachusetts, right? Like a I was born in Massachusetts, Boston. But it could be New York, too. But I feel like New York has another m model that I know of. I just don't remember. And it doesn't seem like it's this. So I'm gonna pick Mass. New York. What? What the fuck? There's no way. How the fuck is that New York? I, I was in New York for three months this summer. I never heard no one say it's ever upwards. Who the fuck? What's the motto of Massachusetts then? Let me see. What the fuck is this motto, bro? Anse petit placidam sub libertate quitum. By the sword we seek peace, but peace only under liberty. That's boss. There's how? Okay, bro. This is my, I think my third one. I think my fourth one, I'll beat it. I'll beat it my fourth one. I feel like vocabulary has got to be easy. Wait, antonym is the opposite, right? In French, antonym, synonym. So ant antonym is the opposite. Even handed means it's, it's even. Just means it's fair. So it has to be dishonorable. But I feel like dishonorable is not even like, not even a good antonym, but it's the only one. It's between Dude, I'm I'm looking at the chat after I already made my decision. All right, Kaya, like I make my decision and then I'm like, okay, let me look at what chat's saying. But like, I'm I'm not cheating. I'm not cheating. Right, let's do math. If Spencer has 21 cookies and eats a third of them, how many cookies Seven. Do eat? Seven, easy. Three times seven equals 21. So 21 divided by three is seven wait 14 what are you guys talking about we there's no it now. the real answer is seven cookies okay okay i'm good i'm good, I'm good. bro you guys are trolling you, you guys are dumb as hell boy <laughs> see chap not that bad right not that bad right life science fuck bro i didn't take like biology shit i don't know and cranberries are all native to what continent Europe? I feel like it's either... Wait, there's no way there's no blueberries in North America by default. It has to be either North America or Europe. It's, like, it, it's kind of hard. Concord grapes. What the fuck is a Concord grapes? Is that different than grapes? Normal grapes? Blueberry... Okay, I think I think this is Europe. I think I'm gonna say Europe. So you're telling me nobody ate fucking blueberries before they conquered America? In 14... When did they discover America? For 1400s, right? Before 1492, no one ate blueberries. That's bullshit. So there's no way it's North America. It has to be either Europe or Africa. But I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I feel like they ate blueberries in Africa. But I, oh, f bro. Okay, technically Africa is a bigger continent than Europe, right? So statistically, it's, there's more likely that it's Africa. I'm gonna go Africa. Please. North America. Sorry, what? 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 No one ate blueberries before 1492? Bro, how am I? S 
I can't be more stupid than XQC and Slicker, bro. This is too much for me. I'm having a meltdown. I'm done, bro. I can't. I can't win this. Train got to sixth grade. Even Train got to sixth grade. I mean, Train's actually pretty smart, bro. Dude has a double major, like, and not just because he has a double major, but he's like, he's actually smart. This one, we win. We, we're gonna win this one. Last one, chat. Last one. All right, let's go spelling. How many times does the letter G appear in the following three-word phrase? Go fight win. Go fight win. So it's two. Two, 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 two. Wait. Wait. Fight. Did he say fighting or fight? Okay, okay. Here we go. Here we go. I'm tripping, man. I'm tripping. Okay, f*** it. Social, social studies. Let's go. What national monument in New York Harbor stands 151 feet tall? Oh, sh**. Bro, you guys f*** me, bro. You guys f*** me. Nice. Uh, you guys f*** me, bro. We're cheating on this one. I don't even know what's 151 feet. Like, if they said meters, that would have made more sense to me. Like, what the f*** is 151 feet? I have no conception of what that is. Okay, bro. You're you're fucking me right now, bro. Abra it has to be Abraham Lincoln, cause Tom or Thomas nice. Jefferson. Thomas Jefferson was like a founding father. George Washington was the first one. It has to be Abraham. It has to be Abe. Abraham Lincoln. Nice. Some point we gotta let Facebook know. Don't worry, bro. They watch my streams. They already know. All right, math. Come on, bro. Math is free points for us. Like straight up. This is nine. Nine plus seven is sixteen. Sixteen plus minus ten is six. This is six. The right answer is. Six. That's right. Dude, I'm focused right now, chat. There's no way I lose. There's no way I lose. I'm having an Adderall moment. If she starts a timer at noon, that means there's at least five hours. Five hours, each hour is 60 minutes. So five times six is 30. 30 so it's 300 minutes plus 45. So it's 345. Let's go. And the answer is 345 minutes. That's right. I'm too good. Easy way out, bro. No shot, bro. I'm picking the hard questions, all right? I'm just good at the hard ones. Can be measured in decibels. This is a sound. Decibels is sound. I know this because I edit videos. What the fuck? What's a rattle? Is a rattle like a sound? It has to be ra a rattle because it, it cannot be these two. It's like a rattle is like a scream. I think we're, we beat our record, right? Oh, it's still fourth grade. Oh, math. Let's go, baby. Bro, if I if I take social at this grade, it's probably gonna be like the most obscure shit in the universe. Evenly bisecting up. 45. It's 45. What do you mean, bro? Isn't this just 45? Am I missing something? 45 degrees. Alright. It's impossible for you to get mad. That's the whole point, bro. <laughs> what do you mean? Bro, if I pick social studies at fifth grade, I'm telling you, bro. It's gonna be like what was like the favorite food of the fourth president of russia or some shit? like there's no shot bro holy shit. oh shit. oh shit. vocabulary bro getting away with something scot-free most accurately means it was done without which of these scottish people <laughs> easy boys we've got it now well the actual answer is Consequences. Man's playing Minecraft on peaceful mode. Bro, I, I gotta at least be able to say I won this once. You know what I mean? Like, I, I won this once. Alright, last one. Come on, chat. Last one. Ain't no way I'm picking any of those. Which of these letters is present in the spelling of the following word, but is not pronounced? Handsome. B. And. Some. D. There's no B. He pronounced D N M. Hand some, right? Can you say it again? Hey, say it again. And some. Okay, you say the M no matter what. So it has to be maybe D. If you know he doesn't speak correctly and he doesn't pronounce the D, he's like handsome, 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 handsome. And the actual answer is D. Too easy. Too easy. Is that it? Subject. Wait, that's it? Yo, I beat it, chat. I beat it. CJ, I'm not that stupid, bro. I'm not that stupid. If I really try, I can beat it easily.